This is a short video explaining how to multiply by 100%. Uh, chances are you've come to this video because you've had a homework problem and the formula that you're required to use has times 100% at the very end. So we're going to explain how to do that. Okay, multiply by 100%. You're going to need to remember that when you see the expression 100%, that it is actually a product that equals 1. Okay, and when I say product, I mean that it's a multiplication problem. This is 100 times the percent symbol. Uh, the percent symbol is a number. Since percent literally means per 100, we know that the percent symbol that is a number, equals 1 per 100. The percent sum symbol is 1 one hundredth. So when you're working with um, multiplying times 100%, what's really going on is, is it's just a conversion factor. And your problem is asking you to convert your number into a percentage. So you're going to need to remember that 100% equals 100 times the percent symbol. And I put these steps here to prove to you that yes, when you, when you substitute, it still comes out to 1. If we substitute 1 over 100 for the percent symbol here, it works out to 1. But in your formula, it says 100%. And what they mean when they say times 100%, they're wanting you to think of it like this. 100 times the percent symbol. Always remember that conversion factors equal 1. So when you multiply a number by a conversion factor, you're not changing the value of that number. You're just converting it from one form to the other. So let's say you need to multiply 0 0.68 by 100%. Essentially what you're doing is you're converting 0 0.681 to its equivalent number as a percentage. And we're going to show you how to do that here. So 0 0.681 times 100%. So we're going to think of this as a product. And we're going to rewrite 0 0.681 times 100 times the percentage symbol. So taking the decimal times 100 gives us 68.1 times the percentage symbol. We're still bringing it down. So now 68.1 times the percentage symbol it's going to give us our final answer of 68.1%. So in other words, 0 0.681, the decimal form of this number, equals 68.1%, which is the percentage form of this number. Now this works for any number. Let's say you need to multiply a fraction by 100%. So we're going to turn a fraction into its equivalent percentage equivalent. So we're going to need to multiply by 1, but we're actually multiplying by 100%. So we have 1 eighth times 100%. We're going to think of this as a product and break it apart. So 1 eighth times 100 times the percentage symbol. Now if you need to, you can convert the 1 eighth into a decimal form. And if you don't remember how to do that, always remember that fractions are division problems. So 1 divided by 8 will give you the decimal equivalent of 0 0.125. We're going to multiply it times the 100 times the percentage sign. So 0 0.125 times 100 is going to be 12.5. We're still going to need to multiply it times that percentage symbol. And then our final answer is going to be 12.5%. So basically what you've done is you've converted 1 eighth into a percentage. So we know that 1 eighth equals 12.5%.